This video will contain spoilers, so if you and or your party that you are with does not wish to learn how characters die and or how the story unfolds, please do not watch this video. Thank you! Jason Hudson, the man with a stone-cold persona. As one of the primary characters in Call of Duty Black Ops and Black Ops 2, Hudson has become a fan favorite. With stunna shades and a badass persona, here is the history of Hudson. Jason Hudson is voiced by Ed Harris in Black Ops and then Michael Keaton in Black Ops 2. Hudson was born in Washington, D.C. on March 26, 1932. He stands at 6 feet tall and weighs around 210 pounds. Hudson has a wife, Jenny, and two children. Hudson has a scar across his forehead. Prior to the events of Black Ops, Hudson served during the Korean War. After leaving the military, he went to school at Georgetown University. After being recommended for his achievements in psychology and political science by Marshall Bryant, he became recruited. Hudson also has an extremely high IQ and is able to transfer it to military strategy. Hudson is a primarily behind the lines soldier, but if needed, he will use his finesse to accomplish any goal. After escorting Mason to the Pentagon to meet with JFK, his true story begins. After the SOG was formed, Hudson worked to investigate Soviet presence. During the Battle of Kisham, Hudson worked with Woods and Mason. After this, Hudson and Weaver tortured Dr. Clark for he made Nova 6 stable. They were able to find out about Steiner and had to escape from the Soviets. The two head to capture Steiner in Mount Yamantau, but instead have to go to Rebirth Island to find him before Mason and a Reznov memory kill him. They reach Mason and Steiner too late and watch as Mason assassinates him. After this, Hudson interrogates Mason profusely. He is the classic voice in the main menu. Who are you people? What do you want from me? You want the numbers, Mason. That's all we've ever wanted. Hudson discovers that Mason was brainwashed to be a sleeper agent for the Soviets to kill JFK. They place the Soviet given numbers to have Mason remember, but nothing works. Hudson then goes to free him and is taken down by Mason. We discover the truth of Reznov. Hudson plays the numbers again after catching up to Mason and knocking him out. They are able to go to the Rasulka. Hudson assists Mason to kill Dragovich. Following this, Hudson is suspected for holding information about Mason as well as being friends with him. Hudson worked with Mason to find a CIA threat. The CIA was going to kill him, Weaver, and Mason after this. Following this, Hudson continued to have CIA control. In 